What you guys got another video here for you. Sorry for the lack of videos over the last few days. I've been a bit busy, uh, but I wanted to get a couple of videos up for you. So I'm just going to do a couple of quick uh, basic videos for you. It might be useful to someone. Uh, you probably know it already, but I'm uh, just going to whack these ones up there real quick just to give you something to watch. Anyway, uh, the first one's going to be how to add your My Computer, Control Panel and uh, all the other types of icons to your desktop. Uh, this has changed a little bit since Windows 7, so I thought I'd show you how to quickly do that. It's pretty straightforward and easy to do. So the first way to do it is by going to your Start button here and then clicking on Settings, then going to Personalization, and then Themes, and then down to where it says uh, Desktop Icon Settings. Now it's been buried deep inside there. I don't know why they've done it so deep there. It makes it a bit more difficult to find, but if you wanted to put your icons on, i.e. computer, user files, network, and control panel, you can do that here. Okay. Uh, the other way uh, to do that would be a simple way of going to the start button, right clicking on that, and then going run. And then you can type in here desk.cpl space comma comma five, just like that, and this will open that straight up like so. And uh, once you've done that, you can then stick on uh, the folders that you want to be displayed onto your desktop uh, the ones you use most and then you won't have to keep messing around down here and it's that simple uh, I do like to have uh, the, the normal standard types here because it just makes access to uh, these locations very quick and easy and to add in some of the other types what you need to do here is go to your start button here right click on that and then go to file explorer and you can see here we have downloads uh, music and other ones here. You could just right click on these and send to uh, desktop, create desktop shortcut just like so and this will add them to your desktop if you wish to do that as well. Very simple and easy to do. Okay guys, anyway that's that one done. Anyway, that's that video covered, so I hope this one helps you out, guys. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, guys, then hit that like button. Also, hit the subscribe button if you want to keep up to date when I upload new videos. If you've got any video requests or any problems with your computers, you can head over to the forums. And if you want to contact me on my Facebook fan page, you can head over there and give us a little like up over there. It doesn't cost you a thing. Anyway, thanks again for watching. Bye for now.